So it's a very big year for Boeing and its 777X program. This of course is based on the aeroplane you see behind me, the best-selling 777-300ER. The 777X is a new derivative with composite wings and brand new engines, which have been in flight test on General Electric's 747 flying deskbed in California. The aircraft itself is coming together now at Everett, where the fuselages are moving through the assembly process and the new wings are being put together from material sourced directly in the adjacent composite wing centre. Now the material itself and the design is very much influenced by another Boeing bestseller, the 787. So let's go and have another look at one of those right here at the show. For the 777X, Boeing is relying on a next generation of the wing which it designed for this airplane, the 787. The example behind me is a brand new example for Biman, the Bangladeshi airline, which was delivered just recently from Everett and brought here straight to the show at Farnborough. Although the 777X will in fact have a metal fuselage, the rest of the structure itself will rely a lot on technology that has been developed for the 787 and very much a lot of the systems technology, improvements in avionics and other features. But of course it's the engine itself which will be perhaps one of the most dramatic new features. GE's mighty GE90 engine has a fan diameter of 128 inches and produces over 115,000 pounds of thrust for the 777. But for the 777X, the engine of course is the GE9X, which is going to be even bigger. It's going to have a fan diameter of 134 inches, making it the biggest ever developed in the industry and it'll produce about 105,000 pounds of thrust. It will be the most impressive engine probably ever to uh, grace the Boeing family. One of the most impressive features of the 777X will be the fact it will have an outstretched span of 235 feet, considerably larger than even the 777 behind me. The most incredible part about it though is that the outer 12 feet of each of those wingtips will be able to be retracted to allow it to manoeuvre through smaller size gates and taxiway areas. The 777X wingspan means that when it's fully deployed, the overall area will be over 5,025 square feet. The actual fold line itself will be just in this area where the kink of the trailing edge is visible just outboard of the aileron. So it'll be a first for any new commercial aircraft and it'll be quite an intriguing feature. Perhaps we'll see that at a future Farnborough air show.